operations with decimal numbers. The sum. It is done like any sum, only with the difference that we will place the comma in the same position in the numbers that are added. For example, 125,321 plus 35.1 equals 160,421. The rest. In the subtraction of decimal numbers it is done like any subtraction, only with the difference that we will place the comma in the same position in the numbers that are subtracted. For example 48.8 minus 33.1 equals 15.7. Multiplication. In multiplication with decimals we place the numbers in columns, as if they were natural numbers, without taking into account the comma, and we solve the multiplication. Next, we place the comma in the result according to the number of decimal places that make up the multiplied decimal numbers. For example, 42.43 by 1.2 equals 50.916. The comparison. You have to start by comparing the whole part of both decimal numbers. The one with the largest integer will be the largest decimal number. For example, 4.55 is greater than 3.23, since 4 is greater than 3. We start by comparing the whole part. All three numbers have the same number, 1. So we have to compare the decimal part, starting with the tenths, and if necessary, we will continue to compare hundredths and finally thousandths. In this example, the tenths are also equal, since they have the same figure, 8. So, we keep comparing and we do it with the hundredths. Hundredths have different value, with the order from lowest to highest.